find the greatest common divisor of 660 and 1400. So if you have smaller numbers, what you can do is you can just list all of the divisors and then just pick the greatest one that they have in common. But these numbers are pretty big. So another way to do this is to find the prime factorization for each. So let's do that. Let's start with 660. So here's 660. And that could be factored or as 66 times 10. Right? You can write 660 as 66 uh, times 10. And 66 is really 2 times 33. And that's really 3 times 11. And then you bring down the 2. And 10 is 2 times 5. And then you just bring down the 2 and bring down the 5. Did that kind of fast. Uh, but you basically just keep factoring each piece and create like a little factor tree. Then take the biggest one. So 2, 2. So that will be 2 squared. Uh, and then... Blah.